I am here with one of the stars of Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows. Uh, can you tell us your name, please? I'm Dobby. Dobby, all right. What was the, the production of this movie like? Oh, uh, you know, it was it was a pretty extensive process. A lot of mystical things and such. I am with one of the stars of Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets, Moaning Myrtle, from straight from the girls' bathroom. So, what's it like in the bathroom? What kind of stuff goes on? Wonderful. <laughs> I find wonderful. We have a real treat for you right now. The Dark Lord Voldemort. How are you doing? I'm doing very well. Thank you. Good. Well, what should I call you? Call you Dark Lord, I, Mr. Lord. I perform Mr. Dark. Mr. Dark Lord. All, we need all the juicy details. You and Voldemort. What's going on there? There's not much to say, but you know, maybe we shouldn't use his name. Sorry. It's he who must not be named, or the Dark, Dark Lord. Lord. Mr. Mr. It's Dark, the Dark Lord. Lord. I'm sorry. The Dark Lord. The, the Dark Lord. So walk us through the average day for the Dark Lord. What's your daily routine? Well, I wake up. I uh, I delegate. Uh, I delegate. I send my Death Eaters to hurt a few people. And Lunch, actually brunch. Oh, I just party all day. Me and Harry, chill. Chill. Till till like late wee hours late. in the morning. Ah, wake up, eat some creatures, and uh, spin a web. I am here with the Weasley family. Introduce yourselves, everybody. I'm Jimmy Weasley. I'm Molly Weasley. And I'm a lot. So what would you say is the Weasley family motto? I would say something more along the lines of, you Muggle know, artifact. use what's there instead of, you know, going out and being frivolous and buying new things. I think we're Frugality. just... Muggle yeah. Artifact. yeah. What are your aspirations? For life? Yeah. What do, you, what do you hope to get out of life now that you, you're liberated? Oh, well, definitely a... A family and kids. You know, I hear that Winky is pretty attractive. <laughs> yeah, let's just... I'm not allowed to publicly say oh. anything. Oh, okay. What would you say is your favorite Nicholas Sparks book? I would have to go with The Notebook. Only because... It's kind of me and uh, Bella Trips' favorite. Do you watch that together? We do. Like Saturday nights? We do. Just kind of hang out? Saturday nights, kind of hang out, do our thing. Try to keep it G-rated. Um, so, so there's, you know, I've been reading the tabloids. It says something's going on between the two of you. And this is by Kitty Fudge. Rita Skeeter. Ah, Cook Cook's Quill, are you kidding me? So, Basilisk. So, what were you thinking when that happened to you? When you're, when you're dying, you look straight to this huge snake. What's that like? Well, I was just sitting in the U bed thinking about death. <laughs> muttering funny words, and I heard it was a boy, so I went out to tell him to go away, and I died. <laughs> so, what kind of things would you say to him if you saw him today? I don't know, I'd probably thank him for death. Well, we have a surprise for you right now. Tom Riddle is here to join us in our live studio audience. <laughs> Tom, come out <laughs> here and meet my morning girl. So they're reunited now. Uh, talk. Why'd you kill her? She was there. What's your favorite Adam Sandler movie? Fifty mm. First Dates. Many good laughs. That's a good one. Many That's good, good laughs. One. That's a good one. So parents, what do you think? Do you approve of Harry Potter? Your we love Harry Potter. Is the chosen. Give us all the juicy details. Well, I can't say a whole lot now, but there are there are rumors. But I'm not gonna get too excited. I have all the names picked out. Oh. I really like the name Albus <laughs> and Severus. So why? What what caused you to open up the Chamber of Secrets? What was your motivation? Well, there's this unsatiable desire for power. The need to eradicate all those who are unworthy. So what do you deem unworthy? Anything that isn't perfect is unworthy. What's imperfect? Well, pretty much everything, which is why I have to destroy it. If someone was to apply to the Death Eaters, what kind of benefits do you have? Do you have like health insurance, obviously, plastic surgery? 
I was just given one of these to look at. Oh, an iPhone. Yes. <laughs> it's, it's a pretty curious object. Oh, Lucius. A chance to use his own iPhone. <laughs> Ron, where are you? Ron, where are you? <laughs> I hear he's out camping. Uh, the cast is great. I really like Emma Watson. Don't really agree with the new haircut, but what do you do? Obviously, I think people should look like me. You know, so she kind of is going for it, but she needs another layer down right. against the skin. Yeah. None of this, none of this none of that, none of that stuff. Anything else you'd like to say to our audience? Stay out of my forest. Muggles beware. The end is close. Vote for me. I'm running for the new Dumbledore. <laughs> you heard it. Dobby for the new Dumbledore. I'm taking the homies to Asia!